As the weather gets warmer, the craving for ice cream gets stronger, and one Detroit ice cream shop has a legacy that will take you down memory lane. That's right. Alinosi Ice Cream and Candy is a soda shop classic, and it now it could be all yours. Kyla Peoples has the scoop. Detroit is known for having amazing historic landmarks, and this place is one of them. This building, sitting quietly in the east side of Detroit, used to be the place to get sweet treats in the city. It was called Alanosi Ice Cream and Candy Shop. The Alanosis has been around for years. It's actually celebrating 100 years, 1921. The Alanosi brothers founded it. At one point, they had seven soda shops, numerous locations. It became a cultural icon and part of Detroit. The Swing and Soda Shop. The Spumoni is what Elanosi is most known for. The slices. It's pistachio, vanilla, and chocolate now, and all the nuts and fruits are sourced locally from Eastern Market. Everything is made right here. Uh, and that, if you've ever been to any of the big halls or catering or any of uh, numerous restaurants in the area and you've ever had a slice of Spumoni, that's Elanosi. It all began with two brothers, Louis and Joseph Alanosi. So the brothers were from Italy, and they came over here, and they couldn't get what they, it's, what do they call it? They say necessity is the mother of invention. Couldn't get the spumoni they wanted, so they started an ice cream business. And the equipment was ordered and made for them in New York, and they followed the old world traditions and recipes. And that's how it started with the Alanosi brothers. While the shop was open, it was a hopping place. There would be lines around the block. The parking lot is across the street. People would be hanging out and waiting. Uh, we had family members behind the counter and putting together specials, and it was always packed. It was packed until the day that they closed. The current owner, the grandson of one of the brothers, is ready to hang up his ice cream making apron. He wants to retire. He's still working. He's still hustling four or five days a week. They're in here at night making ice cream. The current owner doesn't have children and he wants to retire, so we need someone to come in with some fresh energy and hopefully not just pick up the distribution business, the wholesale business, but bring the soda fountain back. So the building and everything inside is for sale. And everything still works. The soda fountain is the way it was. Most of the equipment, obviously things are maintained and this is all original. There's nothing about this that's a replica. Down to the cash register, the chandeliers, the tin ceiling. Hopefully someone will take over this Detroit gem so Alanosi ice cream floats and treats from this location can sweeten the city again. It's always a name that people associate with good memories. It's a name that people associate with some of the absolute heydays of our city, and it just doesn't get more authentic or happy than Alanosi. Heather said that she's been getting calls from all over the world inquiring about the shop and the Alanosi business. Right, so here is the famous Spumoni ice cream that she was talking about that they are still making in the building. So individually wrapped slices, not yeah. scoops. It's pretty cool. I've never seen it like this. So, you know, you've got the green yes. pistachio, yeah. the chocolate. It's like um, Neapolitan almost. Yeah, just different kind of flavors. All right. Little chunks of pistachio in there. Mm. Oh my gosh. It's the best, isn't it? That's ridiculous. Your sister's gonna freak. Uh, she is. I'm just waiting for the text to come in. <laughs> we grew up eating spumoni gelato, so I, it looks exactly like what we used to eat, ice cream, oh my gelato, God, is the same good. it's the best, isn't it? Oh. So I'm just waiting for the text to come in any second now, like, oh my gosh, I can't believe there's spoon, you have spumoni ice cream uh, on the show. Um, and it, it's, to me, I don't know, apparently people say that you can find it everywhere. I did not find this everywhere, so this is great.